Hey cruisers, today we're going to explore the beautiful Oceana Regatta. We'll start from the top of the ship and move from the back to the front. Deck 11 is a great place to hang out. Up here, you'll find a beautiful putting green, cornhole, and one of the coolest shuffleboards we've come across at sea. Dropping down to deck 10, we find Polo Grill and Toscana. We'll first look at the elegant Toscana. Toscana offers a taste of Italy with pasta dishes and main courses and appetizers that are simply bellissimo. Toscana shares this end of the ship with Polo Grill. Polo serves up succulent steaks in a familiar upscale steakhouse environment. Both of these dining experiences you won't forget. If you're lucky enough to get a seat by the windows, get ready for some stunning views. Sunsets here are just unbelievable as well. And on the topic of unbelievable, the library on Regatta also falls into this category. I know cruise ship libraries are typically nothing to write home about, but take a look at this spot. Talk about cozy and check out all of the ceiling art. There's also a modest space for internet and computer access here. Popping outside for a moment, we find the fitness track. This is a wonderful place for an evening stroll after dinner and an excellent spot to take in the views if you're visiting a glacier or visiting a scenic destination. Heading back inside, we come to Horizons Lounge. Horizons Lounge is where the party's at. The party, the tea, and even entertainment. With floor to ceiling windows, it's the perfect place to sip a cocktail while watching the sunset. At night, it transforms into a lively venue with music and dancing. There's also this surprisingly elegant smoking area carved out of the Horizons Lounge. Now onto deck nine, and arguably one of the most popular areas of the ship, the Terrace Cafe. Essentially the ship's buffet restaurant, this casual dining spot has terrific views both inside and out. If the weather is right, this back area is a beautiful spot to enjoy some food and the fresh sea breeze on the terrace. If you're looking for eats closer to the pool, look no further than Waves. The Waves Grill offers delicious bites, and their burgers and filet mignon and lobster sandwich are legendary. And of course, ice cream, smoothies, milkshakes, and more here at the ice cream bar. There's lots of cozy seating, and the proximity to the pool and the hot tub make this a go-to spot on regatta. We just love the service and casual environment here. So what about the pool and hot tubs? Well, see for yourself. Fantastic, right?
And of course, the poolside bar is always ready to craft a cocktail or two. Much less fun than the hot tubs, the Oceana at Sea Regatta Internet Cafe. If you just have to get connected at sea, this is the place to do it and the friendly staff will help you out. I had to swing by when I couldn't get my phone to connect to Wi-Fi and they fixed it right up in no time at all. The card room on Regatta is a welcome spot for all you game lovers and puzzle solvers. Also on Deck 9, the Aquamar Spa and Salon is your one-stop shop for relaxation and pampering. Here's a look at some treatment rooms. And now, the Salon. sauna, the steam room, and lockers are also available here. At the very front of the ship on Deck 9 is the Spa Terrace, complete with the welcoming hot tub. On our sailing, this was for guests who booked concierge-level veranda cabins. The last area we'll look at on Deck 9 is the Fitness Center. The Fitness Center has all the equipment you'll need to work off those extra vacation calories. And there's tons of machines in here along with free weights and treadmills with beautiful views. Dropping all the way down to Deck 5, we'll start with the Grand Dining Room. The Grand Dining Room is where culinary dreams come true, and it's so elegant here. On your way into the Grand Dining Room, you'll find Baristas. This really couldn't be a more perfect spot for before dinner drinks with friends. It's also a great place to stop in for a quick snack or a coffee throughout the day. If you're anything like us, you might enjoy after dinner walks. Out here on the promenade, you can do just that. It's also a great place to take photos. To last a Deck 5 also offers some cozy spots to relax or do a little shopping. Occasionally, there will be live entertainment in this area as well. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. Martinis is probably my favorite place on Regatta. Well, at least my favorite place to stop in for a drink and live piano music. At Martinis, they serve classic cocktails with a touch of flair. And let me tell you, the drinks here are strong. Martinis is located right next to the casino, so it's super convenient for cruisers who are up for games of chance. Test your skills and maybe even win big. 
Whether it's a friendly game of bridge or trying your hand at blackjack, there's fun to be had here. Our last stop on Deck 5 is the Regatta Lounge. This is the place on the ship for entertainment. There's plenty of comfy seating here, a dance floor, and excellent views of the stage all around. Down on Deck 4, we have three important ship services. First up is Destination Services, which is essentially Regatta's shore excursion desk. Here, the friendly staff will help you find excursions and answer those questions about port activities. Next is the reception desk, where you can have general questions answered. Think of this reception area as the customer service desk. And finally, we have the concierge, where they'll cover your concierge level questions with a smile. So there you have it friends, regatta, deck by deck, top to bottom and front to back. Whether you're looking to relax, dine, dance or explore the world, this ship has a little something for everyone. Always elegant, served with a splash of fun and a smile. We'll link to our Oceana Regatta video series in the description of this video and pinned to the top of the comments so you can see more about the experience on this amazing ship. If you found this video useful, please consider subscribing and tap the thumbs up button. Sharing this video with your friends is also immensely helpful. Until next time, we'll see you on the high seas.